Um, welcome back. Please join me as I open us up with prayer. Thank you, Father God, for this amazing day that you have given us today, Father. Thank you for all your provisions. Thank you for all the people that you surround us with, Father. I pray that you provide us with peace in our mind, Father, and readiness to do what we need to do today, Father, and for us to shine our light and that when someone looks at us, they see you, Father, and they see your joy. In your precious son's name I pray, amen. I hope everyone's day has started out great. Now, it is hard to believe, but there are only seven weeks left in this school year. I have a few important reminders for this upcoming week. On Thursday, right after three o'clock, the senior class will be having an important meeting at the school. They will be planning several upcoming events, including Grad Bash at Universal Studios Orlando. I am very excited for you guys. This Friday, April 16th, is a half day. So classes will be ending at noon, which means 12 o'clock sharp. Then on Friday, starting at 1 p.m. the photographers will be at the school to take makeup pictures for anyone that may have missed getting them on March 23rd. Be sure to come by because we do not want anyone missed in the yearbook. Speaking of the yearbook, be sure to send pictures from this year to Mrs. Rosie in the front office. She would love a picture of everyone wearing their favorite mask. Now, this is one of my many favorites. So that would be an example. Um, now, unfortunately, there will be no middle slash high school prom pictures in this yearbook because this year, it had to be canceled. However, I heard that next year's prom day and location has already been set. Now for this week's birthday shout outs. For those that I may have missed, Genesis Martinez from fifth grade turned 12 on March 30th during spring break and Samira Herrera from fourth grade turned 10 last Wednesday, April 7th. Now for those celebrating their birthday this week. This Thursday, April 15th, Christian Hernandez from first grade will be turning seven years old. Also on Thursday, Mrs. Rebolita, the middle school slash high school history teacher is celebrating her birthday. She is not telling her age though. Then on Saturday, April 17th, eighth grader Leilani Kelso is turning fourth, 14. <laughs> Wishing each and every one of you a super, super happy birthday. And to everyone watching this morning, I hope that you have a wonderful week. God bless you. Hashtag Panda Queen off.